adding something, in, some symbols in the background or some things that you really like. So when people look at your portrait, they can kind of see, oh, wow, that person, you know, this, that person must like football. So they know something about you when they look at your portrait. Okay. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to draw the sun because I really like sunny days. You can put one to three things in the background. I'm also going to draw, I'm going to draw like a little rabbit right here, peeping over my shoulder for fun. So I'm just going to add two. There's my sun. It's not going to be like a big landscape. It's just going to be simple, simple drawings of things that interest you behind your portrait in the background. And then it's time to start coloring. So, and again, you're going to be able to choose today. If you want to use warmer, cool colors to show emotion, you can. Or you can use more natural colors, like for your skin tone. So, for warmer, cool colors, like say for instance, you want to show that you're very active. So you want to use a very active color. Um, maybe you want to color your skin yellow. Or maybe a combination of like yellow and orange. Something really active. In this case, you're choosing to, sh to show a more expressionist portrait than a realistic one. There's no right or wrong color choice. Some of the color choices might make people laugh. It doesn't mean that they're laughing at your art, it's just that they're surprised and they probably find it really funny and interesting. I'm actually gonna stay with all yellow so it looks unified. And then um, I'm going to stick because my hair's kind of brownish and it's a little bit blonde, so I'm going to put some brown in the hair. I'm not making it all completely brown because I'm going to add some yellow in there. into my face too much so I'm going to just kind of bring in some more. Add a little bit more over here. Bring in my yellow. Sometimes for adding colors inside of your eyes, in your mouth, as well as in the background. And for my little rabbit down here. So far, I'm not done. 
I'm going to go back in and color all the same way. Make it a little neater. And if you want to add a favorite article of clothing, I like a certain red and white striped shirt, I'm going to add that. 